Hey, what's going on guys? Kyle here and welcome back to Minecraft Survival. Uh, today we are uh, literally just playing Minecraft Survival with uh, no twists whatsoever. Just like the first time we did. Um, no sound, hello? What the freak? I don't have sound. Okay, I did it. It's got sound. Now we're gonna stay that way, right, Minecraft? We're gonna stay that way. That's what I done thought. We're gonna smoke up some more. Gonna fight some spiders. Hey, spiata. Dang, two shot. Absolutely annihilated. Okay, so I've got some string now. I can make a bow or something here soon. Is that a dolphin? There ain't no way there's a dolphin in that. The heck was that? Who goes there? Well, this has seaweed. It is a dolphin. Hey, buddy. He's playing with these ink. The ink bag. So this is ocean water right here. Like I'm getting boosted by the, the dolphin. So this is technically ocean, but like, it's not, what? It's connected to the ocean, but like, that is not part of the ocean, but it's got seaweed and stuff, as if it were, like, that's part of the ocean as well. That's so strange. This seed is so, just magnificent, because over here there's a mycelium biome, if this is the place I'm thinking it is. I'm pretty sure over here is where I spawned. I don't know. I haven't really messed with the world since last time I played. But I'm pretty sure there's like a mycelium biome out there. I need to go back to my home. I don't know actually know where it is by heart. This episode we're going to be looking for food. We're going to find some food and we're going to eat it. And we're going to find a good source of food. Is that a wolf? There's wolves over there. Meaning... It kills me. Oh, wait, I have food. Well, this episode. Objective complete. Now, objective two. We get that wolf. Dude, this is such a nice biome to spawn in. I love this place. This sounds. This sounds super scuffed for some reason. I don't know why. I just feel like it sounds really condensed. Oh no, what's up with that? Uh, but we did find an abandoned mine shaft in the last episode. That is something I do remember. It's been so long since I've played. Freak. It's been so long since I've played Minecraft in general, let alone this world specifically. That I've actually got no idea what I've done last. All I know is that there's an abandoned mine shaft down there. Um, so this episode, I guess, we'll just work on building a house. Which I can do. That's something. Oh, wait, never mind. I don't even have a chest yet. What am I looking for? Okay. So I'm thinking we can build it right here. To where it's like on this peak. Um, which will allow me to get a good view. But also the basement's already dug out. Because this area is hollow. Also, I turned off my 3D texture pack. Um, I don't know if any of you guys liked that or not. Um, but... I had somebody come on stream whenever I was using it. That's a pickaxe. I was streaming with it, and apparently somebody said it was, like, really messing with their head, so I just turned it off, and I've not really been using it ever since then. But, yeah, this episode, I'm gonna build a nice little house. Um, I'm not really sure what how much time I should be throwing into this. Uh, because I'm pretty sure last time I recorded, I just recorded I played for about 15 minutes and then edited the video in one day and then uploaded it that day so I'm thinking same process for all of my minecraft videos because I want to keep this to be a simple series I don't want to like overdo it at all because um, I feel like this series the point of it was supposed to be just a time for me to sort of make videos consistently for you guys uh, allowing me to interact with you in more current times while also not really having to stress myself over editing it the way that I want it to be edited or whatever because 
if I can just have fun playing the game and enjoy myself, it's a lot less stress on my part, and I feel like it gets a lot more of a genuine sort of feeling, um, it's like, it, it, it shows you guys more of the real side of me rather than, like, the, um, oh, haha funny YouTube man side. Uh, because there really isn't a haha funny YouTube man part of it, because I steal all my content from all of my friends' reactions to things. Um, so that way I just get absolutely free content um, just from leeching off of others, which I feel like is the smart way to go about things. You know, okay, that's not what I meant to do, but I'll take it, because I don't really like saplings, not spruce at least. How fast do sticks burn? Because I feel like if I throw a stick in there... It'll keep it burning enough to finish that one. Or it'll just finish burning anyway. Okay, sweet. So I have enough iron to make something. I don't know what. But. Check it out. I can start building here now. Which means. I'm going to do that. Just going to take this out. Um, I don't know why, but I've been whistling a lot. Just randomly. I wonder if I have Tourette's. That's not a joke either. Um, that's not like a, a bit about anything. I genuinely wonder sometimes if I have Tourette's because I just do random things uh, like sort of subconsciously. Um, and I, I don't know if it's just me acting on a whim or if I genuinely just do it because of that. I doubt it. I doubt I have Tourette's. I, I think I would have noticed it before now, but I mean, you never know. This isn't going to be something I uh, I would push on Twitch or anything like that for, uh, you know, oh, watch me, I have Tourette's. You know, uh, <laughs> I wouldn't be <laughs> crazy about using it for views. If anything, I'd try to not show it because... I don't know. I, I, do, I just don't like baity people. I, I don't want to bait people into, like, watching my stuff. I, I feel like the way to do uh, YouTube or, like, any sort of content uh, creation correctly is by genuinely building up an audience that likes your content and what you're doing on your channel. I feel like that's the right way to do it, and that's the way I want to do it. Because I never want to try to trick people into watching my stuff. I want to make stuff and have people genuinely like keep coming back to it because they actually enjoy me as a like a content creator rather than sort of haha <laughs> got him you idiot how dare you uh, click on the funny boob filled thumbnail and get Minecraft video you silly goose um, I I just don't want to be that guy. I don't think it's, I don't think anybody should be that guy, honestly. But, I mean, I guess there's always a sort of hustle to everything, and that's just some people's way of making their money. Uh, it's not a good way, uh, by any means. I think it, people who do that is extremely annoying. But I know I've had the sort of subconscious, like, in the back of my mind thought. Um like what if I made like a a false channel where I just sort of did the hustle I made super baity content low effort content that people watched to where like I used the robot voice whatever like text-to-speech to narrate everything I had no name behind my face but it's just a pure money like generator I guess it's just pure profit from little to no effort. But I feel like I'm not really above that, but I feel like I just don't think that that's the right way to do things. I don't want to do things the scummy way. I want to genuinely build up a viewership base and make content that people actually enjoy. You know? This would be the the survival minecraft where I just consistently talk about growing myself on YouTube and what I want to do on YouTube while I cut down trees for a video yeah you know it's just the lumberjack lumberjack uh, talks okay it's getting dark 
probably should have found a bed. I probably should have made one. I don't know how the frick I'd find the bed unless I went to like a village or something. Okay, so there's like the sort of main frame. Okay, go ahead and get up there for me, buddy. Alright, sweet. This place is dangerous to hang out with. Huh. Probably gonna fall off this and die, but it's whatever. Okay. Now it's night. Go ahead and throw my blow up my safety block up. And go mining. I feel like it'll be a lot safer and smarter to just do all of my mining at night. And I guess now is as good as time as any just to brave this um, mine shaft. Did I ever give myself an easy way down? Of course I didn't. Because that would give them an easy way up. Huh, okay, so did I ever go down here at all? From the looks of it, no. Do I have torches on me? I have like four. Okay, sweet. I'm just trying to light this up real quick. Ooh, that's diamonds. That's diamonds, bro. Bro, I already found diamonds. I can't get those yet, because I need more iron. Holy crap. I found diamonds in, like, the second day. That is extreme luck. Dude, this seed is awesome. I don't even know what it is. This is a great seed for the channel. I like it a lot. Bro, there's so many of them, too. There's at least four here. Or, there's at least three here. Well, let's dig around these bad boys. I want to see how many there are. My luck, it'll just be these three. Maybe, yeah, a fourth there. But, okay, so this is sweet, actually. Okay. This is awesome. Dude, life's been good recently. Honestly, I, I mean, I, I never really talk about my... I feel like I don't talk about my personal life much online for a good reason. Um, but let's just say I'm pretty happy where I'm at in the real world. <laughs> okay, there's more diamonds in here. That's... There's a golden apple, more diamonds, some rail, and more torches to explore with. Okay, that's a lot of torches. I don't know if I already had those for, or... I, I guess I just made a few, so I... It's a bit more than I thought. Okay, so I've already found diamonds. Oh, shoot, hello. Oh, there's my torches. I hear spiders. You know what kind of spiders those are? Poisonous. Mine chefs are always kind of scary because you never know where the sounds are coming from. Like, I don't know where any of these mobs are. I haven't seen anything. It's all just quiet. It's not really quiet, but... You know, it's all just sort of... Oh, freak. This is probably where most of the mobs are, is up this upper level. All the mobs that sound like they're right beside me are probably, in reality, up here. Oh, frick, that's a creeper. Okay, we got for this bad boy. Oh, frick. Don't blow up. Okay, I just said don't blow up. What do you do? You blow up. This is just like my girlfriend did. Tell them not to blow up, and then they do it. They just completely ignore your advice and just do it anyway. It's a shame. More iron.
more iron. Okay. I just hope there's not another creeper that's deciding to give me, go dead silence mode. May I really say a Call of Duty perk? I'm probably going to bail soon so I can go back and get more wood to make torches. Because I don't really have any wood. I have a couple of logs, but I want to use that for the house. Okay, let's get back to the surface. We'll get me some iron tools and then I'll come back. Because this trip should hopefully give me like a full set. 17 will not give me a full set, but it will get me a good amount of tools and a little bit of armor. Which will make braving this a whole lot easier. And I actually managed to find my way back. I don't know why, but abandoned mine shafts really have this like innate ability to just get me super lost inside of them, and I don't know why. But I always get the most lost in Minecraft only whenever I'm like actually in like an abandoned mine shaft. Other than them, I have a pretty good sense of direction. Throw some coal in there because we we got a good source of it now. So I probably should add a chest. No, how close is it to being daytime? I bet it's about me. No, it's not. It's actually pretty close. I see a spider. You know, that was part of my problem. Why I didn't stay down there was not having sticks. Why did I expect to get some? You know, it's all going to be spruce anyway, so I might as well just make the sticks now. So that'll get me pickaxe. And then I need eight for the chest plate, so I'll save up for that, because that's the most durable part of the armor, which means if I make one now, it'll break with the rest of the armor or at least around the same time so all of my armor will break at once which is nice for replacing because then I can just replace it all at the same time and I'll have a lot more kit by then if I don't already get it by the time I go back down there being that I've already found a good amount of diamonds I'm kinda of thinking about saving those diamonds until I get like a an enchanted pickaxe that will um, guarantee me like fortune <laughs> I'm thinking about waiting until I get fortune to actually make that. There we go. I've already got a iron pickaxe and a iron chest plate, which is pretty sweet. I just made a 64 stack of torches, which means I'm going to go explore a little bit more with my mediocre tools and the dream how do I not see this the first time going through okay this right here is an awesome spot okay I just found so much more diamonds Bunch of redstone, some lapis. What the heck? Dude, this is awesome. That's a lot of diamonds. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six. That's six diamonds right here. Okay. And they got some lapis here, which means I can do some enchanting later. Which is sick. I got some redstone here, so I can do some redstone later. Which is sick. It's been a while since I've just sat down and played a casual game like this. And so this is a, a really nice experience. Because most of the time I'm just playing like hyper competitive games in a hyper casual way. Which is what I do with Siege. Because it's a really easy way to hang out with my friends while not like... Well, still like having fun, you know. Cause this little back area here has got quite a lot of loot. I think I hear a bunch of spiders above me. Let's 
this game doesn't exactly support vertical audio, so it's a bit difficult to figure it out. What? Oh, frick. Yeah, they're definitely above me. Like, they're like a block above me. <laughs> yeah, they're definitely out here in this. Yeah, that. Oh, frick, that makes sense. Run. Ow, ow, I knew that was coming. Ow, ow. Poison sucks. Poison sucks. Yeah, okay, so they're like right above me. Oh, hello there. How the heck are you not seeing me? There's two of you. Just gonna ignore you guys. You guys can have a good day. Please ignore me. What the freak? Oh, shoot. I'm full on iron. Wait, no, I need sand. For glass. Find the useless materials, like andesite. Okay, sweet. Got it. Bag secured. Let's go. I'm out. <laughs> it's daytime now. So sweet. So we're back on the surface. Let's go ahead and start working a bit more on the base. And then this nightfall, I think I'll call it quits. <sighs> okay, so how the heck am I supposed to get up there? First of all, I'm going to need some more spruce logs. For chests and for building the house. Because I must say, I'm running a bit low. Okay, now let's make some logs. Okay, so that was exactly 64. That was a very good, very nice and lucky amount. I should probably build at the platform first, as well as some stairs to get up to it. Um, then again, who really needs stairs? Whenever I have this over here, sweet, okay. Yeah, let's build the platform first, uh, because that'll get me at least sort of a, a start to the base. Okay, maybe I should have built the chest. <laughs> so I can actually store the uh, materials I don't need that I have on me. That'll make life a whole lot easier. Okay, then we just throw everything in here. Let's start making our move into the actual house. Come on, pick it up. There we go. Oh yeah, I don't think pick it. Okay, so I think I just lost some experience because I did that. Because in this version, I don't think you actually get experience from breaking furnaces. Fur and I. Uh, yeah, let's just throw all that in there. I've got a lot of stuff I want to do here on the channel soon. I just never know where to like start or where to go with the project or like how to how to go through that workflow. I've just been so out of it for so long. It's it's almost like a new thing to me again. Okay, sweet. So we've got some walls, some floor. We're moving up in the world. 
Literally, because we are at a very high and elevated position. Let's see here, that's three. So let's build three out there. Let's make this a symmetrical base. Uh, I'm thinking we can do some terraforming here and fix that. But for now, I think I'm just about done. So I'm gonna light this place up. And just like that, I'm gonna thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you'd like to hit that like button down below and I'll be sure to make yet another uh, Minecraft playthrough whatever on this world. And yeah, I don't know, I've had fun. I'd like to come back to this series and actually work on it more solidly like I used to. And I say like I used to because I only had one video, so I worked pretty solidly on it for that one time. But anyways, thank you all for stopping by. If you did enjoy, be sure oh to subscribe and put on notifications so you know when the next one comes out. It'll probably be like three weeks, but who knows? Maybe it'll be out tomorrow. It definitely won't because of my scheduling. Uh, the sooner it'll come out will probably be like the next Saturday or Wednesday. But anyways... See you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.